This is SportsCenter, coast to coast. All right, so good morning from the West. Kerry Champion here with David Lloyd. David, I would like to announce uh, to everyone after yes. last night's preseason game, <laughs> LeBron, Lonzo debut, playoffs, here we come. We haven't been since 2012, so it, this is it, David. Did you feel it? Uh, well, let me be the first to say congratulations on this stirring playoff run that your Lakers have put on. Uh, also, how about the Timberwolves situation? We thought uh, they were having practice today. Yeah. Now they're not having practice. Hmm. Let's dig in here, Kerry. So what is the latest? What does it all mean? Joining me now is Adrian Wojanowski on Coast to Coast. Timberwolves, as just mentioned, canceled practice. What's the latest you're hearing on where things stand between Jimmy Butler and Thibodeau? is to get the owner uh, to move that way. After his actions yesterday, was there any indication that they're leaning toward keeping him or moving him? It's good to know, uh, Woj, you actually answered my next question was, uh, did this make any other teams pause before thinking about trading for him? Uh, we've heard some people question his leadership. We'll talk about that a little later on on Coast to Coast. Woj, thank you for being here. Thanks, Kerry. Born before you were born. Acho, joining me now here, college football analyst giving us the the lowdown here on Coast to Coast. We want to make sure we get it right. You prefer Acho as opposed to Manny. Acho has a little more swagger to it. You know Great. what I'm saying? Great. So we're going to go with Acho, folks. Ohio State playing uh, its last game without head coach Urban Meyer. They are 2-0 without him. So let me ask you this. What does it tell you about that team if they don't have the leader at the helm and they're still able to be at 2-0? They're incredibly talented. They'll pull off the upset. That's the question of all questions. First yeah. and foremost, you got to give credit to TCU's coach Gary Patterson. Sure. He's the best He's the most under Remember what I just said. Let's switch uh, to a game that might have a little more meaning for you. We're talking about Texas, your team. Yeah. Texas Longhorns, USC. Our Paul Feinbaum said that essentially he thinks that head coach Tom Herman is in danger of losing credibility. Oof. So consider that. What's your take on what he's been able to do there so far? And, and, and what would it mean to beat USC? Whatever he's been able to do, he has to do more. We'll put it like that because last year. you being here. Acho joining us on Coast to Coast. David, I'll send it back to you. Okay, Carrie. Uh, tragically, Canelo be too small. That's okay, it. Okay, well, that's it. Those are the differences, Teddy. But as, so I'm a boxing fan. Tell me what I need to be looking for outside of those two things in the ring. Now, you said, will one look old and, and, and the size difference, but tell me what I should be looking for. I, I wanted to get that smile. I just wanted to get that smile out for the audience <laughs> one final time. What we should be looking me, for is the first. Appreciate that, Teddy from Vegas. Meanwhile, folks, let's talk about it. Tomorrow night, our top-ranked boxing main event. Reed has signed with the Carolina Panthers. Reed, who joined Colin Kaepernick in kneeling during the national anthem to protest racial inequality and police brutality in 2016, has been a free agent since March. He continued to kneel after Kaepernick left the team. In May, the NFL Players Association... Hey, David, it's uh, time for our top stories. Right. I want to be just as excited as those guys we showed, but this is about Thursday night football. I'll start with this, my main reason. Our colleague, Hannah Storm, will yeah. call the game with Andrea Kramer on yeah. Amazon. How about First that? time. Yeah, it's exciting. First time two women will call a major men's team sporting event, not just football. How do you feel about that? I love it. I, you know, I was working with Hannah right before we got back together here on Coast to Coast. So who, go who ahead, do you love have more? fun. Who do you love more? Uh, I can't. Well, I, I got to do this top story here. He wants the truth, folks. Uh, Stan Van Gundy joining me now here on Coast to Coast. Uh, after being on air late last night, we appreciate you turning around and coming in today. Um, so I have to ask you, as we watch that conversation, great job by Rachel Nichols, by the way. Um, as a coach, and I want the coaching perspective, Timberwolves cancel practice today. How would you have handled that situation? Well, look... They could have canceled practice for any number of reasons. and he, he read his team and he knew what they needed for today is what you, what your thought is on this. A absolutely. I, I think he went through yesterday. A lack of leadership or he questioned his leadership. What do you feel about Jimmy Butler's leadership when it comes to what happened yesterday? And, and, and Rachel made it clear we can't talk about being traded. But if you're on the outside looking in, do you want Butler on your team? Yeah, look, he's a great talent. He valued. We all want to feel that, do we not? <laughs> we do, but if Jimmy's being honest, it's about money. Oh, okay. and, and let's be honest, it's about money. Now, it might be money. Honest. All right, keep it funky and keep it honest. This is about honesty. That's what Jimmy said, That's right? That's what he said. Stan Van Gundy joining us here on Coast to Coast. I appreciate it. College football season is here. Emmanuel Acho also here to give folks at home an update on their teams and Saturday's matchups. So we're talking about Georgia first. So here we go. They have a tough stretch of games. They face LSU, Florida, Kentucky, and Auburn. All ranked teams. So in your opinion, 
Who gives Georgia the biggest headache? I got to go with Florida. First and most. Wisconsin headed into Ann Arbor to play Michigan, a top defense facing an outstanding rushing offense. What's going to be the key in this one? It's all about Jonathan Taylor. Oh. He is the highest man hopeful <laughs> this year mm -hmm. than he did last year. So it's all on Jonathan Taylor. All right, shoulder. folks at home, you know this rivalry game, Washington facing Oregon. Who has the advantage? Will it be or Oregon's quarterback, or where are you going with this one? I'm going to go uh, with uh, Washington's defense. All right. Nothing to be played with, and you see, they play with emotion. Emotion. We like it. As you as you explain this with emotion. A little bit, a little bit. All right, <laughs> sticking in the Pac-12, undefeated Colorado facing USC. What would a win against USC mean? It's getting over that mental milestone. Colorado is has lost 12 against USC. USC. Your time with this one. Uh, a couple of winless coaches, Scott mm. Frost at Nebraska, Chip Kelly at my school, Ouch. UCLA. You played Ouch. for Chip Kelly yeah. when you were with the Eagles. Yeah. What's going on with the 0-5 Bruins? You know, here's the thing. Uh. Over against Bethune Cookman. All right. But they got to figure it out. We'll keep looking around. Meanwhile, there are four Big Ten teams and four SET teams, SEC teams ranked in the top 15. Looking ahead to the college football playoff, who could be left out in terms of Divisions. If Notre Dame runs the table, they're yeah. in. So then you got to think who gets left out. I'm going with the Big 12 okay. and the Pac-12. Oh, you has a loss. Remember, so I'm thinking the Pac gets left out, the Big 12. Those two conferences, out. done. Two. All right. If Notre Dame wins. All right, thanks. I appreciate it. That's Asho here with a quick rapid fire. Meanwhile, rapid. Saturday. Here on ESPN. You knew that, though, didn't you? Uh, yeah, well, it says it here in the prompter that that was going to happen. <laughs> just read the glass. Uh, so read just the glass. read the glass is what it says. It's been a pleasure and a wonderful day. Always a great job. And tomorrow will be Friday to boot. And we'll, we'll try to get that.